Okay, so what we're going to go into in this video is publication subscriptions and um, and uh, uh, meteor methods. So what we have is uh, what we have so far is just this login button and the ten items that we put in the first one. Not no big deal. And then our file structure is uh, we have client. Uh, library and server, um, and you can see everything. You got the client, then you have a views folder. Inside views, you have the items, uh, and the items has that. And then there's the main that HTML. Uh, haven't changed anything. Uh, got the same collection, same server. Okay, so now we are going to do uh, another collection, and we're going to call this uh, clicks equals new meteor dot collection clicks so that's all we did uh, everything's fine we're, we're good to go um, and we're gonna do and we're gonna add what's called a meteor method meteor dot And all we do here is pass the name of a function. We're going to call this add click. And then we're going to give it a function. And all it's going to do is do uh, click.insert. Then we're going to give it uh, a, number, a random number is equal to map.floor math.random times a thousand and I think I didn't break anything so yeah we're good and all this is is just the name of a method which we're gonna call add click and then it's gonna add uh, just a random number uh, for a click so now we go, so this is our meteor method. Now we go to items.js, or no, let's go to uh, items.html. And in this HTML file, we can add uh, a button, which we'll just do button uh, class equals btm, btm, and that's just for bootstrap. Uh, All right, and this should add a button. Yeah, we have this this button that we can click, and it doesn't do anything. Uh, even in the even in the console, you can see that clicking this doesn't do anything. But we're gonna make it do something. We're gonna give this an ID. Uh, ID equals um, we're gonna call it add. And now, if we go into items.js, we're going to create um, we're going to create a template dot items dot events, and this is going to list. This is all this is doing is listening for events. So what we're going to do is add click on what was the name of the button? Add. Okay. When we click the add, we'll call a function. And this function, all it's going to do is do uh, meteor.call, and then the name of the function that we want to call, which we called add click. If we go into the server, add click. Now, assuming this didn't break anything, which I don't think it did, um, if we click this, it should have added a click. So now we can check to make sure, oh, click is not defined.
Oh, it's because I forgot the S. Sorry about that. So now it's restarted, and let's make sure that this works. So we click that, and no errors. And click. All right. No errors. All right. So now we're gonna make sure that the Mongo works. We're gonna do db dot clicks dot find uh, one. And uh, so you can see that we are successfully um, adding clicks, which is just this clicks dot insert no math floor random thousand. Um, and now for items.js, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do we're gonna do the same thing we did for we're gonna do the same thing that we did for um, All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna do template.items. Dot dot, and then we're gonna do show clicks uh, equals function. And all this is gonna do is return clicks.find. And then we need to add that into our HTML. And for this, we're going to do strange. Um, anyway, what we're going to do is we're going to do each show clicks. Uh, each and this actually should be a pound symbol and we're gonna just do uh, another p tag and we're gonna do num and all that's gonna do is show us all the numbers from the clicks. And you'll see that every time I click it, this uh, this gets updated on the bottom. So that's kind of cool. But um, that's because of a, a package called uh, auto publish. Now, if we want to remove that, we just go meteor remove auto publish. So this means that all of that stuff that was automatically getting published is no longer getting published. So these, these are all getting uh, integrated, but they're not being published. So what we're going to do for that is we're going to create a publication in the server. So what we do is we meteor dot publish. Um, I'm going to do clicks. Forget the syntax. Yeah, so it's just so it's just meteor dot publish and then the name which we're gonna call clicks and then function. And it's just going to return uh, clicks.find. And uh, something is wrong. Oh, nope. So we're good. Okay, next we need to we need to add up a subscriber. So what we do then is go here. Uh, 
cd into our client because our client is subscribed to the server so let me go to um, i'm going to make a directory called lib uh, cd into lib uh, make a directory called subscriptions cd into subscriptions uh, touch uh, clicks .js. How's it going? I'm gonna do video dot subscribe clicks. And just like that, we've subscribed to every click. And that's the basics of uh, subscriptions and publications.